Namaste. This is Ali, and this recording is being created live in the rainforest of Costa Rica. And so there might be some sounds in the background of different wildlife and perhaps human activity in the distance. Um, so please take a moment to adjust your headphones and your volume to the perfect level for this particular experience, which is a little bit of a low-tech recording. <laughs> so just adjusting your volume as necessary for this low-tech recording today and take the next few moments to begin to settle in and get your body supremely comfortable. So you might have props that you're adjusting, perhaps an eye covering or blanket or some supports for behind the legs or behind the head. And then taking some extra care to make sure that each region of your body feels completely supported and at ease. Noticing your legs and your hips. Are there any little adjustments you could take to get even more comfortable? Noticing your spine, and your back, your arms and hands. The position and comfort of your head and neck. Are there any little adjustments you could take to get even more settled in so that you can arrive in stillness with ease. And as you take those final little adjustments, begin to welcome and open to the experience of sound. You might be noticing the different sounds here in this recording. Sounds of the wind and the trees. Sounds of the wildlife in the rainforest. Noticing the different layers of sounds from insects to birds There are also howler monkeys in the area So don't be alarmed if I at some point you hear the sounds of loud primates. And then also noticing the sounds in your environment. Could you notice the closest sound And then opening to sense farther away into the distance. Noticing if you can sense the farthest sound. 
farthest sound in the distance. And just letting yourself start to relax into the experience of sounds. Letting the mind relax open. Letting the jaw relax heavy. Encouraging the tongue to soften, perhaps even drawing tip of the tongue to the roof of the mouth. Letting go of effort in the face, in the eyes, in the forehead. and noticing each breath, feeling the rhythm of inhales and exhales. You might sense aromas and sensations inside of the nostril. And with each exhale, might you allow your whole body to soften and become heavy. Whole body releasing and letting go. Each exhale allows you to sink a little deeper into stillness and total relaxation of the body. Might the whole body feel held by the support of the earth Feeling yourself on this steady density of this ground that supports you, that's beneath you. And the comfort of your yoga nidra nest, this cocoon of support that you've created for yourself. Settling deep down into the support and into your practice. During the practice of Yoga Nidra, the mind remains awake and aware, open and receptive to the seeds of good intent, to the messages of healing. And while the mind remains awake and aware, there are parts of the mind, parts of the brain, that will be in a deep state of sleep the body in a deep state of sleep and the brain waves will slow down slowing down into deep delta brain wave states there are different states of consciousness that can be explored in the practice of yoga nidra 
and you can trust in your body's innate wisdom and your subconscious mind's ability to know what you need your subconscious mind's ability to listen to the guidance no matter what state of consciousness you arrive in. So as you begin to surrender to the practice of Yoga Nidra, might you begin to welcome the presence of your heart. Allowing the mind to dissolve into the presence of the heart space. And noticing the rhythm of breath here at the heart. and begin to welcome your heart's desire, your true north direction in this life. If you have a sankalpa that you're working with, you can begin to invoke that now. If you have not formulated a sankalpa at this point in your yoga nidra journey, you might welcome the phrase, I trust my body to know exactly what it needs. I welcome the healing effects of this practice on my body, mind, and spirit. Repeating an internal whisper three times. welcoming this sankalpa to reverberate through each and every cell of your body to cascade through every channel, every river of energy, every nadi in your body allowing your whole self to be enveloped by the energy of this sankalpa and any of the somatic feelings that it invokes within your body. You might just imagine you could simmer, simmer in those experiences, those sensations. And then bringing attention to the crown of the head, welcoming any of the sensations that are present here at the crown of the head. From the crown to the mind's eye in the center of the forehead. Noticing sensations. From mind's eye to the right brow, sensing the eyebrow, and then the temple, the cheekbone, and the right eyelid and lashes, the eye itself, a radiant orb of sensation and all of the little tissues behind the right eye softening and relaxing 
releasing. From the right eye over to the left eyebrow, sensations of the brow over to the temple, and then the left cheekbone, the eyelid and the eyelashes. The left eye itself is a radiant orb of sensation. All of those little intricate muscles behind the left eye softening. Let and go. Sensing now the sensations inside of the right nostril. The flow of air. Sensation within the right nostril. The left nostril. The flow of air and sensation within the left nostril, the upper lip, the lower lip, sensing the teeth and the top of the mouth, the gums and the roof of the mouth, and then the lower teeth and the gums, and the sensations at the floor of the mouth, the inside of the right cheek, the inside of the left cheek, the tip of the tongue, the right side of the tongue, left side of the tongue, the base of the tongue down to the root of the tongue and the sensations of the jaw, the right side of the jaw, the left side of the jaw, and sensing over to the right inner ear the folds of the ear and the earlobe and the sounds perceived by the right ear. Sensing from the right ear back down towards the jaw and the throat and then sensing over to the left ear canals, the inner ear, the folds of the ear, to the earlobe and the outer ear, and noticing sounds perceived by the left ear. And from the left ear down back in towards the throat, dropping down to the throat center, from the throat center to the pit of the throat, to the center of the heart. From heart to the right side of the chest, shoulder, upper arm, elbow, wrist, the palm of the hand, the back of the hand, thumb, second finger, third finger, 
fourth finger and the small finger. Sensing all of the fingertips, fingernails, the space between the fingers, and a sense of the whole right hand. From the whole right hand to the whole right arm. Sensing the volume and shape of the arm and the sensations present within trillions of cells in the right arm. Sensing down the right side of the body the underarm, the rib cage, the waist, the right side of the belly, the right hip, the thigh, front and back, sensing the knee, from the inside out, the calf and the shin, the ankle, the sole of the foot, and the heel of the foot, the top of the foot, the big toe, Second toe, third, fourth, and the small toe. Sensing all five toes of the right foot and any space in between the toes. Sensing the entire foot from the inside out. And a sense of the whole right leg. And the whole right leg and the whole right side of the body. The right side of the belly and the torso. The arm, the neck. right side of the face and simultaneously could you invite the left hemisphere of the brain so you're sensing the whole right side of the body and the left hemisphere of the brain simultaneously the whole right side of the body and the left hemisphere of the brain full of radiance sensation you might imagine you could sense the breath and energy flowing through the whole right side of the body becoming saturated with sensation and aliveness throughout the whole right side simultaneously welcoming the left hemisphere of the brain simmering in the sensations gradually letting your attention condense back in at the center of the heart and from the heart center to the left side of the chest 
the left shoulder, upper arm, elbow, forearm, wrist, palm of the hand, back of the hand, the left thumb, the second finger, third, fourth, and the little finger, sensing all of the tips of the fingers on the left hand, fingernails. A sensation of space between the fingers. Noticing the space in between and around the fingers. And sensing the whole left hand. Feeling the hand from the inside out. From the whole left hand to the entire left arm, sensing the volume of the arm and the sensation of trillions of cells alive, full of rich sensation, warmth circulation in the whole left arm and then sensing the left underarm the rib cage waist left side of the belly the hip the front and back of the thigh, feeling the left knee from the inside out, the shin and the calf, the ankle, the sole of the foot and the heel of the foot. The top of the left foot over to the big toe, second toe, third, fourth, and the little toe. Sensing all five toes of the left foot and the tips of the toes and the space in between the toes. And beginning to sense the whole left foot from the inside out alive with sensation and the whole left leg and foot together sensing the whole left leg alive vital the whole left leg and the left or so the arm and hand, the left side of the neck and face, the whole left side of the body alive with breath, saturated with sensation, 
imagining you could feel and sense the breath flowing through the whole left side of the body. And simultaneously the right hemisphere of the brain. The whole left side of the body. And the right hemisphere of the brain. Sensing the whole left side, right brain, simultaneously. And then could you sense both sides now together? Both sides of the body equally becoming saturated with attention, sensation. Feeling the aliveness throughout both sides of the body. And sensing the whole front of the body the whole back of the body. Whole front of the body. Whole back of the body. And sensing the whole body simultaneously. The right side the left side, the right brain, the left brain, the whole front of the body, the whole back of the body, the whole surface of the body, and deep inside the innermost core of your body. As you sense your whole body resting so deeply on the earth, begin to notice your breath, sensing the whole body breathing. You might imagine as the whole body breathes that you could inhale or breathe in through the mind's eye center, the center of the forehead, exhaling through the center of the forehead, inhaling Imagining at the mind's eye center, exhaling. Just imagining. You could inhale through the center of the forehead, exhaling back out through the forehead. The mind's eye, one of the portals into the state of Yoga Nidra. You can stay right here 
or you can move down gently to the second portal at the throat center. Inhaling. Imagine breathing in to the throat center. Exhaling through the throat center. Inhaling, throat center. Exhaling, throat center. Just imagining you could inhale and exhale at the center of the throat. Moving from the second portal down into the third portal into the state of Yoga Nidra. Letting your attention drop down into your heart space. And as you feel each natural breath, could you imagine breathing in to the heart? Exhaling back out through the heart. Just imagining. Inhaling to the heart center. Exhaling through the heart center. And now exploring down into one final portal. Letting attention draw down into the low belly, just beneath the navel. Imagine you could breathe into the low belly, exhaling. Inhaling with your own natural rhythm of breath. Could you imagine breathing in to the low belly? Breathing out through the low belly.
allowing yourself to dissolve into the breath. Becoming one with the rhythm, gentle rhythm in and out. As you rest here in the embrace of pure presence and deep, deep rest, could you welcome your sankalpa to be here once again? You might feel it wrap you in a warm, energetic blanket, or you might mentally whisper, repeating at your own pace, I trust my body to know exactly what it needs, I welcome the healing effects of this practice on my body, mind, and spirit. And now begin to welcome a sense of your body breathing and a sense of the support in which you are resting, the density beneath you. 
begin to welcome all of the different sounds. The sounds of the jungle in this recording. Any sounds occurring in your own environment. And letting yourself begin to slowly come back from this state of consciousness, from this state of empty fullness that is Yoga Nidra. And be ever so slow and gentle with your body and your mind as you begin to deepen the breath. You might take a big inhale through the nose and then exhaling through the mouth. Maybe a couple more times inhaling and exhaling. Taking a deep breath in through the nose and out through the mouth. And another deep breath in and out. And maybe one more time for good measure, in through the nose. And letting it all go. Slowly beginning to bring small movements like a touch of the thumb to the finger pads or a movement, a subtle movement of the toes. And then gradually bringing in more movements one by one, nodding the head slowly or maybe rolling the ankles, the wrists. You might take a big stretch through the arms and the legs or you might reach the arms and legs up to the sky and rotate ankles and wrists in a gentle inversion very gentle inversion of the legs and the arms. You might hug knees into the chest and gently rock from side to side or make your way over into a fetal position. Know that you can take a few more deep breaths when you feel ready in through the nose, out through the mouth. I'm just continuing to welcome the benefits of this practice. The benefits of this practice as you start to reawaken, as you start to reemerge. And know that there are so many wonderful benefits of the practice of Yoga Nidra that are really becoming so much more widespread through different research studies and it's so exciting to see all of the different benefits that are really like um, these positive effects that come from the Yoga Nidra practice and some of these include, and you might notice if you sense any of these, if you notice any of these, you might let me know in the comments below. But there's studies that show Yoga Nidra improves our mood, increases our resilience, reduces our stress levels, boosts our concentration, improves our cognitive processing. It can boost memory. It can increase alertness. 
It really enhances our self-awareness. It can reduce depression and also post-traumatic stress disorder. It also has been shown to improve anger management and increase motivation. There's so many studies showing that uh, yoga nidra, it really helps us with sleep and reduces insomnia symptoms, improving our sleep quality over time. Um, there are even studies that show that yoga nidra, it lowers our blood pressure when there's a consistent practice. Some of you have actually um, shared this with me in the comments before. Um, those of you who monitor your, your heart rate and your blood pressure um, and even your blood sugar levels, there's studies that show yoga nidra practice can improve our blood sugar levels and help to correct with hormonal imbalances. So there's just so, so many widespread benefits of this practice and I'd love to hear from you in the comments below if you're noticing any of these effects uh, in your own life, these positive effects in your, your, own, um, your own experience of, of practicing yoga nidra and that cumulative, the cumulative effects that, that can occur um, with practice over time. Thank you so much for being here with me today and thank you for joining me in this low-tech recording. Um, I actually had my, my good microphone stolen out of, out of my car a couple of weeks ago, so I'm making do with what I have here in Costa Rica at the moment. And uh, hopefully the sound quality was okay. I'm, I'm fingers, fingers crossed, I'm going to put it out there anyways, even if it wasn't uh, top quality. And I, I'm really thankful, thankful for you for being here, thankful for you for continuing with your practice of Yoga Nitra. If you would like to learn more about the location that I am currently um, guiding from in Costa Rica, where we host our week-long retreats, I am going to share a couple of beautiful little meditations on the sounds in the scenery of this sacred land uh, in the end of this video and in the tags and I'll put some in the in the comments below as well. So if you'd like to learn a little bit more about the this area and if you loved the sounds of the jungle, um, these meditations I I would highly recommend people really love to connect with the with the sounds of the rainforest in these little meditation practices. So uh, I'll share those for more more resources for you to connect to to nature and to the natural world through through the sounds of the rainforest. And uh, if you're here from our Yoga Nitra teacher training. I can't wait to hear from you in the comments. Thank you so much for your ongoing check-ins and uh, for your uh, presence in our community and your just beginner's mind and openness to learning and experiencing and, and transforming. So uh, let me know if you're here and let me know one thing that has shifted in your life since you've uh, taken uh, or began the Yoga Nitra teacher training. It can really have these profound uh, changes in people's lives when they go really deep, really deep with us in the online community and into the practice and into guiding and all of the philosophy and all of the wisdom teachings and the scientific studies and everything that we dive into really deep in our 100-hour online yoga nitra teacher training. So I hope to hear from you and I hope that you have a most beautiful day today. Thank you once again for being here. Thank you for being part of this online global sangha community all around the world. And uh, you might let me know where you're tuning in from today, where you're practicing from. I love hearing um, what area of the world everybody is, is practicing together from. And may you be happy, may you be healthy, may you be peaceful, may you be free. Namaste. And thank you for being here.